All right, what are we doing today? We got the Nexico N660P webcam camera. I've been using this for probably four to five months and haven't looked back. I love this camera. It was affordable. It's easy to use right out of the box. You can easily plug it into your computer. It comes with a good mount that hooks onto your screen. And underneath, if we look right here on the back, here's some stats, by the way, real quick. But underneath right here, there is a mount where you can uh, mount this to a tripod. So that's really handy if you have a tripod and maybe, uh, you know, it doesn't fit on your screen properly or whatnot. But get it out of the box. It has a USB that hooks up to it. You connect that to your computer. You take this USB. Let's connect it to the camera. Simply put it in the USB slot. And then you admire your computer baby and then also what's really cool is you got this privacy filter so if i don't want you to see me bye okay come back i miss you but like i said i've been using this for four or five months it can do 720p at 30 fps or 60 fps 1080p at 30 fps or 60 fps it does have other options in there that you can do 960 by 720 i think is one is more of a squared format most people are going to be using 720 or 1080p i know i bought this for when i stream my video games if i'm jumping in warzone if i'm playing apex legends or if i'm doing lawnmower simulator which is my favorite got a new 60 inch skag baby anyways we're getting off topic but as you can see this is the 1080p at 60 fps and i'm gonna back up move around you know, and I'm using the USB mic right now, not the uh, camera mic. So I will demonstrate that here in a little bit. And then I can move it down to 720p. So you can see what that looks like. Sweet. Let me move back out, see how the autofocus is. It does just fine. And so it's got really good quality. And it's 65 bucks right now on Amazon. It's a great uh, camera to get started with for uh, your business meetings, your gaming adventures, whatever you need it for. The built-in speakers, you know, it is what it is. It's a webcam mic. Really, you need to uh, invest in any microphone or a microphone like what I got, a USB microphone. If you're relying only on the webcam mic, if you're in a big echoey room like what I'm in right now, you might hear uh, reverberation, you know, different, you know, if people in the back or kids are running around back there, you're probably going to hear all that through the camera. It's going to annoy the person on the other side. So I would always suggest with any w webcam, you get your own good mic. And that's for a different video, a different day. All right. What you have here is you have settings on the camera that you can also adjust the brightness, the contrast, the hue, saturation, sharpness, gamma, white balance, backlight, comp and gain. You can choose to mess with that as much as you want. I don't have any need to mess with it. It looks great coming out of the box. It seems like it's already calibrated to where it needs to be. And then you got camera control, zoom function, focus, exposure, pan, tilt, roll, low light compensation, all that good stuff. I don't mess with that. Camera is great right out of the box. So you can hook this up to a tripod using the screw mount on the back on the underneath side of it. You got the privacy filter and also the camera will tilt to the side and also go back and forth up and down. You know, you got, you got different ways you can move it. Hopefully I can get it back somewhat normal. So that way you can you know, adjust it to any needs you, uh, you may have. So what I use this camera for is gaming and streaming and I've never had this camera fail me. It works great. It's very easy to use. And right here on Amazon, I mean, for 65 bucks, I didn't want to dish out 180 for, you know, another camera that got, that gets a lot of good reviews. And I didn't want to go cheap either because then you'll end up having to buy another one later on. This is in the middle and I couldn't be any happier with this. And there's different colors. So you can do the uh, black and gray one. You can do the pink and white one. That's an extra $4 or so or $5. And then you got the white and gray, which looks really clean. I like that one too. But if we scroll down to the uh, reviews, you got 72% of people who bought this and reviewed it uh, rated it a five star and 17% four star. 
you have photos right here. People have taken photos with their camera. They all look happy and, and very satisfied. If you read a lot of the reviews, that's what helped sell me on the product. There were so many good reviews and that right there. If you got a product that has great reviews, a great price, a great picture quality for, for, for the price range it's at and, and good enough speakers. To, I mean, what else do you need? Why spend the extra hundred bucks on some other camera? I mean, so anyways, that's my opinions on it. I just wanted to kind of keep the review short, simple, and sweet, but hopefully you liked it. If you did, please let me know in the comments. Please like and subscribe if you liked it. Thank you.